I forgot to do the top tops, just the bottom screen, didn't I? Oh well, that's okay. Chip Chip Crane Store Show Stage. So this is where they hold the swashbuckler spectacular, huh? Looks like the police are done with their work here. Hey, it's you lawyers! How could you let Sasha get arrested? Didn't I ask you to take care of her? We're sorry we couldn't prevent her from getting arrested. But as her lawyers, we'll do everything we can for her. Sora got upset. If there's anything I can do to help Sasha, just say the word. Marlin, you can trust in Mr. Nick. I'm going to do what I can too with this forensic -ing kit. I'm going to cover this whole area with forensicking. That a girl, small fry. You have free reign of this place. I want to check this place out, but I better talk to Mr. Rhymes too. Let's talk to Mr. Rhymes. Helping with cleaning. I hear you're help Sasha with the cleaning, Mr. Rhymes. Well, not really helped. I was just taking care of the orca here while she cleaned. Sasha felt bad for making her little stamp so late, so she asked me to give her a snack. I was a little bit less than her ordinary meals, but she seemed satisfied. Oh yeah, and I put Orla on the transport stretcher too. Transport stretcher? See that hoist up there on the right? The stretcher can be suspended from it. This stage show is right next to the Orca pool room. And we use the hoist to move the Orca or cargo between the two areas. So the rail we saw in the Orca pool room runs all the way here, huh? Why did you want to take a ride? Aerial investigation, huh? Sounds good to me. No, no, that's okay. I like my investigations on sweet terra firma. Actually, the hoist can only be operated from the orca pool room. Oh, that's right. I remember seeing the hoist control panel in there. So I'm sorry, but I can't give you a ride without somebody's on the other end. No need to be sorry. Phew. Dodge that bullet. About the murder. Moide. If it wasn't Mr. Buckler or Orla, Ms. Buckler or Orla, who else could have killed Mr. Shipley? Well, I know Sasha's innocent, but I'm not sure about the orca. What? But we proved her innocence in court this morning. A few days ago, that orca attacked Sasha right here in the show pool. I saw that orca take Sasha's body in her mouth and squeeze her chest. Her chest? They were probably practicing a lifesaver trick. But Sasha was being crushed so bad she couldn't even blow the whistle. I wanted to help her right away, but I hate to admit it, but I froze. I, I'm a weak man. I can't protect anyone. I doubt there are many people who would pit themselves against an orca. Everybody tried to talk her out of it, but she wouldn't give up on practicing. When we said Orla could kill her, she said she trusted Orla. Yeah, while well, everybody else seems to think Orla is a killer. How can you trust a creature that can't speak, can't even know what it's thinking? But with orcas and dolphins, you can have communication of the heart. About the moida. Let's examine. Eek! There's a skeleton adrift. <laughs> it's just a prop. Are you really scared? A little bit. Why you're screaming? Is this skeleton an enemy defeated by all the pirates? No, he's an informant named the Skeleton Kid. A dashing, spirited character, neither friend nor foe. So you're saying he's alive in the show? Look at this pool, it's huge! So this is where they do the swashbuckler spectacular. The show pool is the same depth as the orca pool. They practice the tricks in the orca pool and then do the real show here. Are you interested in this washbuckler spectacular? Of course, I've only seen it on TV though. Well, I'm new here, so I've never even seen it once. Athena is a big fan. She watches the recording over and over. I love the show and the ocean. Standing here makes me feel like I'm at the beach. Especially with it open to the sky. You can even hear the sound of the surf nearby. Why don't you take a dip in the pool? Really? I can? In that case... What? What are you talking about? You can't swim here. We were just joking. Right. Of course I was joking too. Don't tell me she was actually going to do it. This ladder only goes down to the surface of the water. Well, it's not like a public pool. Everybody who gets into this pool knows how to swim. Just like in the courtroom. It's sink or swim in there. A newbie could really get hurt. You know... Like last time in court, I could have really gotten injured. I was an inch away from getting attacked by a witness. Yeah, a trial with Apollo can be pretty dangerous affair. This colorful sign. Did Miss Buckler make it? 
Wow, how did you know? Yeah, that sign is for the new show. Before she went to clean, she painted it and left it dry. She told me to keep an eye on it while I was taking care of the orca. Oh, isn't that Skull Rock there on the right? Mr. Rhymes, is Skull Rock the part of the set of the new show? Yeah, I guess so. If they were going to use it in the show, what's it doing in the orca? It's not so eye-catching with all those twinkling stars. I think they're supposed to be starfish. It's the, for the pirate show, after all. Hmm, a few of them look more like leaves to me. Sasha put so much effort into making the song for the new show. No wonder she was mad about what happened. Huh? I wonder what he's talking about. I better ask. Talk to Mr. Rhymes. The new show. You say Miss Buckler was mad. Was it because of the new show? Ugh, me and my big mouth. Okay, but you never heard it from me. There was a rumor that the captain wasn't going to let Sasha be in the new show. What? But why not? I don't know. It was just a rumor. I don't know if it was true. So Mr. Shipley is going to do the show all by himself? I can't even imagine the show without Miss Buckler. It would be like, where's the beef? She's trying to say it would be like bones without any meat on them. Sasha wanted to go back to the old Swashbuckler Spectacular, but now that the captain's gone, who knows what's going to happen with the show. Mr. Nick, I found some peculiar fingerprints. Pearls, I almost forgot she'd been forensicing for me all this time. Oh, who's that? <gasps> Simon! Prosecutor Blackwell, what are you doing here? Just some business to attend to. Prosecutor Blackwell insisted, so I brought him along to get a little exercise. Is it business with us? No, not you. My business is with that animal keeper there. Marlon Rhymes, you will be a witness for the prosecution tomorrow. You gotta be kidding me! Why would I want to testify against Sasha? What you want does not matter now. Come along. But if I leave, who's going to feed the orca? The other animal keepers are too scared to go near her now. Um, maybe I can help. I'm concerned about Orla's help. And this way I can stay close and look after her. I can feed her and do a telecast too if you need me to. I'll do anything to help. Sounds like Pearls wants to do something nice for Orla and make sure she's okay. Small fry, are you tripping? That orca is dangerous, you know. Hehe, <laughs> I'll be fine. I'm just happy to help. Oh, but I don't have a TV phone. I won't be able to contact you if I have to do a telecast. Marlon, may I please borrow yours? What? Sure, Small Fry, anything for you. Especially when you're going out of your way to help like this. I don't know if I'm going to testify, but I guess I can at least hear what the police have to say. Thanks for your cooperation. Now justice will be served with the strategy meeting. Grr, come on, Mr. Wright. Let's get back to our investigation. How sad. The police have already investigated all there is to investigate. Your efforts are a waste of time. Nothing we do to try and save our client is a waste of time, Prosecutor Blackwell. Today, the Orca. Tomorrow, Sasha Buckler. You intend to save them both? <laughs> you say your belief in your clients, but isn't money really your true motivation? Why not admit you're only doing this for your own benefit? I can understand that much more readily than your empty righteous talk. Our own benefit? That's not why we're doing it. Now, Athena, try to not to let him get to you. All right, we should be off, Prosecutor Blackwell. Grrr, I've never been so insulted. Be right back, I need some water to wash away the anger. Uh-oh, she hit Prosecutor Blackwell with that water. He doesn't seem to care, though. Hmm, I guess prosecutors these days are more about harsh monochrome than fancy frills. Oh, wait, what about those peculiar fingerprints you said you found, Pearls? Hehe, <laughs> I'll tell you all about them. Pearls. Peculiar prints. So tell me about this big discovery you made. Well, I don't know if it's a big discovery, but... I found some odd fingerprints on the pool ladder over there. Okay, so what's so peculiar about them? Well, they're on the left side of the ladder, but they're, but they're right hand prints. Wouldn't a person usually hold the left side of the ladder with their left hand? Plus, I think they were made from above by grazing the ladder with the right hand. Hmm, now that you mention it, that is strange. I wonder whose prints they are. 
I compared them with Prince of Final and they turned out to be Marlins. How did he manage to leave Prince in such an awkward position? So, Mr. Nick, was I helpful? Yes, you were. Thank you very much, Pearls. I don't know if they're related to the case yet, but I'll keep them in mind. Hee <laughs> hee, I bet Detective Fulbright doesn't know about these prints. I imagine their search wasn't as thorough here as it was with the crime scene. You're probably right, I'm sure they checked everything on the actual crime scene. But I guess they can't do forensic on every inch of the rest of the aquarium. But we could, thanks to Pearly, and now we have a new piece of information. Oh, you're embarrassing me, Athena. Hey, it's Rifle! We gotta catch her! Don't worry, she's being a good girl right here on my lap. Haha, <laughs> well, I'm glad she's been found. I forgot we were looking for her, actually. Yeah, thanks again to Pearly. I think somebody's jealous. Well, I think I'll go talk to the staff about Orla. Alright, good luck, Pearls, and thanks again. Well, I guess we're done with things here. What do you want to do next? How about if we have a pile to check out our mystery evidence? Oh, that's right. We haven't done that yet. Good idea. Let's stop by the office. Oh, you're back! How's the investigation going? It's going pretty well, but there are still things we need answers to. Let me know if there's anything I can do to help. The investigation. Would you like to help out with the investigation, Paul? You bet I would. What do you want me to work on? Hmm, let's see, do I actually have anything for him to do? Okay, and it's suddenly crickets. Oh, I know, boss. Let's have a look at the evidence we collected. Oh, good idea. You might notice something that will help us with the, the case. Present the pair. Apollo, there's something I like your help. You have to you have work for me? What is it? Did you have this capsule checked out? I think it's some kind of medicine. Sure thing, Mr. Wright. I'll go to a hospital or something and have somebody take a look. Let's see. Pretty sure the closest one is Hickfield Clinic. Good luck, Apollo, and thanks. I wonder if they'll let us see Sasha tomorrow. It has been quite a while. Let's stop by the detention center and see. We have something to deliver to her, too. Don't forget. 